Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another Louis Vuitton review. My name is Emilio, and today we have ourselves a little coin pouch. Now, really quick, I've actually had this coin pouch for about mm, four or five years, maybe six. I'm not quite sure. I've had it for some time, but I never did a review on it. So, hey, why not? It's a very popular item. I think it's a staple in Louis Vuitton accessories and stuff like that. So, let's just do a quick review of it. Usually comes in a box something similar to this. Um, and when I got it, it was the brown boxes, but nowadays, Louis does the orange. Burnt orange. Nah, maybe it's not burnt orange, but it's close enough. Anyway, probably will come in a little dust bag such as this. And then, voila! Here we go. Um, this is the little coin pouch from Louis Vuitton. Uh, this is the brown, the brown canvas, as you can see. LVs and stars and all that stuff comes with a little gold chain. Uh, you have the option. I don't know what you do with it. Um, I personally wear it on my belt loop and on the side of my pants. So if this is me standing like this, and this is the front of me, uh, it, it dangles right here on the side right here. And it's lasted quite some time. The quality build on this is fairly good. Now granted, uh, there's been a couple times where I've actually broken uh, the gold part right here, or at least the chain right here, because sometimes this thing just likes to fall in between seats, and if it falls in between a seat and then you get up and it's like stuck like this, this thing will break off. So you can just, I think you can probably bring it to any Louis Vuitton store and they will actually replace it. I don't know for free, I got mine for free, but I feel like they were changing the rules so maybe it might cost you some, maybe I don't know, 10, 15 dollars or whatever. It took about two weeks to get it back, or a week, probably two, I think it was around two. Mm, five to ten business days, we'll say that. So, but this thing is, is uh, they didn't replace the whole chain, they just replaced the little, uh, whatever it's called, there's like a little part right here. Whatever broke and snapped, they just replaced that part. So, it's, uh, it's not hugely thick, uh, but it gets, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven credit cards, eh, maybe six credit cards comfortably, and I usually keep a little money in there just in case, zips like this, like I said, you can optionally put this inside, and it's just like a little pouch, and throw it in your pocket, if you don't want to have it like, you know, dangling or anything like that, but this is good to have because like, it clips onto your belt loop, uh, real quick, if you don't know how these things work, they're, they're a little tricky, but once you learn it, you're good. It's like riding a bike. So let's see, I'm trying to get this close to the camera. So as you can see, clip like this. So what you do is you push up on this thing. See how it's moving up? And it just opens up. So push up and turn it out, and then boom. And when you close it, just kind of like push it in, and it just usually just snaps right into place. Uh, this thing, this mechanism has worked uh, ever since I got it. They've never replaced this gold on it is still in pretty good condition the only rub off I see is right around this general region and this like I said I've had this for four or five years uh, this is the only part that's really have been worn is this part but like I said it's always dangling like this so as I move it and sway and it gets caught on stuff like that um, this this part just kind of just came a little undone uh, not a big deal though to be honest with you it's still when you zip it it, it stays in place pretty well uh, also, this part right here, um, all the credit cards that you can see, they kind of stop right about here. And when I sit down and stuff like that, I kind of sit on it and it bends. After years of bending and stuff like that, it has cracked. I have not treated this. Mm, I don't think I've ever treated it with any leather thing or anything like that. So that's probably why it's cracked like that. But if I took better care as in terms of like conditioning it every once in a while, because they say condition it every year or two or something like that. It probably would have kept the better moisture so it would bend and not crack as much but I still think it probably would have done it anyway because anything that has a lot of stress with this canvas cracks um, like the like the shoes that I've showed before in my other review the white shoes they've had the, anything that has a crease like this it's folded it, 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 it just starts to break down after a long time or really quick as opposed to the shoes because the shoes I don't know why they just broke really fast anyway this is them, this is it. Uh, what else? If you have a, I mean, this is the only other wallet I have. So size wise, you get what I mean? I mean, they're basically the same size. Fits in your pocket really nicely. If you want to wear it as like, you know, just like a pocket thing. 
or keep it dangling. People, if you dangle it, don't keep it in the front of your pants. That hits your balls. <laughs> Unless you like it hitting your balls, whatever, that's up to you. That's just your choice. People, I don't know, I've gotten like things like, some people said, hey, you should wear it in the front on a chain, make it long, dangle longer. Like, dude, why would I want that? It'll, it'll be just, people will just grab it and steal it. What is wrong with you? Oh yeah, there's people, yeah, you might get yelled at from people like, hey, your wall is hanging. Bro, watch out, someone might steal it. Like, dude, no one's gonna steal this thing. Well, maybe they will, who knows. Anyway, the zipper, good quality zipper. Like I said, it's lasted five, six years. This thing has been through the, the, the mud and, and whatnot, and it's, it's, it's held the test of time. The only thing that is bad is just this part right there. But like I said, it has no effect on the quality of it. The, the rest of it is, has just been kicking like a dream. This chain, though small, it's, it's held up really well. And like I said, I've got it hooked on things so many times, it's only broke once. But I've had it, like, I've gotten up and, you know, like, oh, it pulls and tugs. It still lasts, it still, like, stays connected pretty well. That's a pretty, pretty solid grip on this thing. Oddly enough, it seems like it shouldn't be, but it is. Can you see inside there? I don't know if you can or not. But the metal ring that holds it, it looks small, but it's actually pretty good. Pretty freaking good. So, if you're interested in getting one of these, I don't know how much they cost. They're, like, actually, I think it's, like, the, the least expensive Louis Vuitton item you can get, almost. I'm almost positive on that, and it comes in an assortment of colors. Uh, they have not made this in the Eclipse as of yet. When they do, look out for that one, because I will be getting that one. I need, like I said, black is the new black. I'm trying to upgrade all my brown to black, and this is the last thing on the docket to uh, upgrade. So hopefully I'll get it. We'll see. Anyway, if you like this review, give it a quick little thumbs up. I would appreciate that. Share it with a friend. They would appreciate that. And uh, also subscribe because you might see some more things that maybe you're interested in purchasing. And I will do a quick review and show you how they how they stand up, you know, through abuse and stuff like that. And, and wear and tear. I'm not going to bite it. I was going to, but I don't want to put my face in the camera because, you know, bad hair day. Can you see it? Yeah, it's bad hair day. Anyway, my name is Emilio. Enjoy the rest of your day.